We have a podcast. Whoa, whoa, whoa. We have a podcast. The link's out below. Do you have the teleprompter ready? Yeah, just when I say something, it's going to switch to what you say. Okay. Hello, we are brothers Jacob and Lucas, and today we are going to go to Claire's. Just in case you didn't know, Claire's is a store primarily made for tween girls. They sell accessories, toys. That, that's your line. Oh, and most importantly to me, they do ale piercings. What is going on? I'm done with 2021. Can we just go back to 2015 when everything was fine and dandy and great? Help! Well, I guess I'll just continue driving to Claire's. Claire's are usually located inside of a mall. We passed the food court and went to the Claire's. We had entered paradise. In all honesty, I wasn't planning on getting an ear piercing from Claire's. It just wasn't in my agenda for the day. But I arrived to Lucas's house and he said, why not get an ear piercing? I decided to get an ear piercing. And actually it was funny because Jacob said, I'd actually be down to get an ear piercing. I said, oh, why don't you? And then I said, oh, I just don't want to. And then I said, oh, so you aren't down to get an ear piercing. And then it kind of like made your mind twist and you realized, wait, oh, I am down, so I might as well do it. I didn't know I was allowed. Yeah, that's we all, I'm not. I'm not in like a cult or anything. I just didn't know I was allowed. <laughs> this isn't on video, but I had Lucas ask them if I could get an ear piercing because for some reason I felt too uncomfortable to ask them. Please don't ask any more questions about that. Yeah, you literally said, it just feels awkward bringing it up and it's like, oh, that's their job. So you know <laughs> what I mean? Thing about it that's like, like <laughs> being at Chipotle and saying, it's awkward to bring it up, but I want food. It's like, that's what the whole vibe, that's what, it's all set up for that. And Lucas counted me out because we were just standing in the same spot for like three minutes, not even joking. And Lucas was like, so are you going to get it or not? And then I was like, oh yeah, like, I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> First of all, with getting an ear piercing, they sent me over to this booth and I got to pick out of these piercings that I have to keep for like six weeks because you have to keep oh, it, yeah. them in for six weeks so the hole doesn't close. Because if you don't keep the piercing in, the hole will close and then you can't put earrings in, earrings in to penetrate the hole and you can never penetrate the hole again unless you go to Claire's. It was all about like this whole... Then the girl with the rainbow mask handed me this like contract to sign off on and I, and I was just like, okay, I'll do it. <laughs> they actually informed me after I signed that I sold my soul to Claire's. They can use me for ads and also I have to work there once a week now for the rest it of my life. Wasn't something about like if someone needs your organs, they're allowed to take them out? Yeah, I have a big microchip in me and they said that I can now be used as a telephone line. I guess I can stand yeah. in the country and people can connect to my ears for But it's not a big service. deal. But just, if you do do this, a little bit of advice, probably have your lawyer look it over. It's what it is. I mean, I still got my ear pierced. Yeah, that's all he wanted. So he, he's happy at the end of the day. I told the lady that I was 20, but she still had me do the parent Gaudian pout. So I just put Lucas as my Gaudian. You're a full ass adult. My ears were really dirty, she said, <laughs> so she had to wipe off all this dirt and mucus. Oh yeah, you to claimed you showered me. today. I mean, I, I thought I did. But she I was just thought surprised. I did. She was surprised, like, what is all this shit? She said there was actually shit on your ears. <laughs> <laughs> She's done this many of times, I bet, so she was just like, Another little girl wanting to get all ears pills. And she let, you, she let you double check that the placement was right. I asked you and I was like, I think it yeah. looks good. And it, and it did turn out good. So props yeah. to the rainbow mask. And in the moment, me. like, there was a thought, like, are they too low? But then I was like, I'm not going to say anything. No. Okay. I had to admit that part of me was like, no, too low. But no, I love them. Yeah, but they now they look low. good. Even though I thought that, and you literally asked Lucas, what are you thinking? I just said, they look great. Because like, I'm not going to tell I you. trusted the artist. Yeah. We, we, so just like you have to put it in their hands. She did a great job. <laughs> this is an ad at this point. Mm -hmm. Oh, go bows to the wall! It's time for the thing to go into my ear. Oh my gosh! I had no reaction because I love pain. I actually was like surprised because you literally didn't make any reaction. Even the girl was like, "Wait, like, are you all there?" It just felt like 
like I was getting the flu shot. I feel like I was just prepared. Like how bad did it feel like someone, like you know when people pinch you like this? Did it feel like that? It was like that times five. She Wait. said I was the bravest girl who's ever got my ailments. How come if anyone ever does this to you though, you would cry? Oh. Should I actually try it? Oh, because in this scenario I was prepared. Like, oh, was okay. it like this? Uh, no it wasn't like that, but if you pinch me that might be something. Oh, let me see. Oh, yeah, it was like that. Oh my god, do it to me, I want to see what it feels this like. This is what it felt like. Ow! Oh! It felt like that for two seconds. But how come you not? Oh yeah, I guess I, I would have been composed in a moment too if I was at this point. Oh, it would have been funny if I would have- <laughs> <laughs> It turns out if you get ill piercings, you get 20% off everything you buy, so I- I was ready to hit Claire's. Go ham, mother! I was so ready because they were playing I Love It by Kanye West in a little pump. Such a fucking hoe. I love it. And I did feel like a hoe, which I liked. I was surprised by the Claire's prices. Like these weird like clip things. And I was like, oh, let's get like two of these. But then I turned it around. 20 bucks. I thought this was 99 cents. I know. I thought this was a store where like it's a bunch of janky shit that breaks in a week. If you see anyone wearing Claire's, they have money. Anyone who shops at Claire's is a future girl boss. <laughs> Just so you guys know, in those first few bits, we were only in the front of the store, but then we saw this whole other mirage. They had like home decor, all this other stuff. The store just kept going back. And I think we walked back like, I don't know, my phone said I walked two miles back. So I don't know what was going on, but we just kept walking and it never ended. My legs are sore. Then we got a bunch of goodies, we checked out, and I walked out of that Claire's with the biggest internal smile I've ever had. You are $145 less rich. Yeah, if anyone was wondering, it was $80 for the air piercing. I have no idea what the average air piercing costs. Should I Google it? Yeah, Let's I don't do know where you got, got ripped off. Uh, Body piercing studio is about $20 to $50 with the jewelry. Yeah, it says an earlobe single is usually $25 to $50. Yes. Why is Claire's more expensive? Maybe because, I bet you like these other places you get your ear pierced or like tattoo parlors where like people don't want to bring their kids there. Yeah. Like, this is like the one kid friendly place, right? We have a bunch of stuff and we're gonna show it off. Please don't be jealous. And just to be clear, we are not bragging. Actually, we are just a little bit. Oh, first of all, you should do like a little tour of the kit oh, they gave okay. you. Hello, my name is Jacob Beauty and um... This joke has been done so many times, but I'm still gonna do it. I got my ill pills at Cleo's today, and I'm gonna show you what's inside of the box. Oh my gosh, piercing ills for 40 years? I've only been alive for 20 years. They, they've done it before I was alive, but I'm pretty sure women have eggs in their stomach the whole time they're alive. But that's only half of me. I don't know about men. My dad, would I have been in his stomach? In his balls. No, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, his balls. I'm pretty sure men produce semen every day. Yeah. So I might not have even. I don't know where I was. On with the video. They gave me this little thing. Um. Oh, this is actually the contract where I signed my soul. Uh, blur okay. it. And then they gave me an exclusive Claire's air solution thing. You're supposed to clean it three times a day. I think I'm gonna follow because I don't want to get a bacterial infection or whatever that. Three times a day? Like, that's a commitment. Water, alcohol, meth. I actually wasn't expecting that. Thanks for watching! What was in there? You fucking broke something. <laughs> what is it, fragile? Did you get a vase? First of all, we have to try this cell phone makeup kit. It's bedazzled, which totally fits my energy. Yeah. The whole store is just one big bedazzle and you really get down to it. Lucas? I'm pretty sure someone opened this already and they returned it. I'm not even joking, y'all. Do you guys see that <laughs> both of hell? these? It looks like someone rubbed their finger in it. First of all, I saw like, oh wait, why isn't it sealed, you know? Cause like anyone could just open that, but some little ass kid literally dug their little granola bar hands in here. God. That just goes to show like be a better, be a more smart consumer. Check the product before you buy, you know? I wanna damage it cause I'm angry. My angle got the best of me. 
Do you feel uncomfortable around me, Lucas, right now? Yeah, I didn't... I kind of spell it. Why you have such a... I didn't know you were violent. I, I'm over it. I spoil. All okay. right. Should we get back to the hall? Yeah. Guess what it is? I'll give you a um, five, four, three, two, one. It's a comb. I didn't know it until I opened it, and I was like, wowza. You open it up, you see your beautiful face, and then you can push this out, saves room. Oh! Hey, Lucas, I booked my appointment for 3.43 in 10 seconds, I'm here. Oh, hey! I know most hairdressers stand up, but I'm just gonna sit down, because what's the, what, why don't we just, you know what I mean? If you get to sit, I get to sit, is what I always say. Can you move your head this way? Um, I want a Brazilian wax with my hair. Um, I'll ask, um, the janitor if he's down. Ew, why do you comb my hair like that? With that, I just realized someone probably opened that too, and I'm gonna have lice now, and I've never had <laughs> lice. You actually are gonna have lice. Fucking. Today hasn't been good. <laughs> I mean, I already have lice, yeah. so I'm just gonna commit. Oh my god, E-boy? Yeah. Since I just combed my hair, it'd be best to use this two-in-one glitter color neon hairspray shit. You just really are doing the whole on like appearance change today. I think I just decided I don't know how I feel about myself, so let's make it more confusing. Don't get it on are my- Are you allowed to do this inside? Don't get it in my eyes, clothes, or anything. It's fine. This is so gross. There's glitter everywhere. I'm leaving. Oh my god, this was not- It's everywhere. It's literally everywhere. We're breathing in toxicity. Let's not do it anymore. I don't know what this is doing, but I think Should we do it outside? It's ventilating. Oh my gosh, this is such a mess. How long should I do this for? Another minute. Okay. <laughs> What I want is for like my front pop to be blue. Oh, okay. So put your hand over your forehead so it doesn't get on your hair. Thanks. Okay, that's enough. Ew, what is on my hand? Bye. Okay, how do you feel? I mean, kind of looks cool, but it mostly just made me annoyed. Yeah, it was stressful. Because it got everywhere. There was going to be glitter on me for the next week. Then for yeah. another week. Um, it's all over my hand. There was a time when I did have blue hair, so it's like homage to that era. Oh, yeah! Oh, my God. <gasps> Let's move on to the next item, shall we? I got this seventh heaven... Like glitter mask, and I know I just was complaining about glitter, but what is gonna put more on? I love how like Claire's is getting into skincare. It says even though you're 12, you should be worried about aging. So please put a mask on. You don't want wrinkles for high school. I mean, it's a good message. It doesn't really feel like there's anything in here. Did someone steal? Okay. <laughs> this is literally effing glue. Don't put it in my mouth. <laughs> I'm not. <laughs> The only thing is, like, I feel like since you're an adult, like, this is made for, like, a little kid face, or, like, I don't know if it's gonna cover your whole face. I mean, does it look like the photo? No. It looks like I just put shiny goo on my face. Glitter tabulous! <laughs> Glitter tastic! Next, we got these gloves. The reason being is because I want to add to my wardrobe. I also oh. like how they they have like a glove for like, ooh, I'm a fancy girly girl, and then like, I'm like, badass. Let's put them on and see if anything changes about us. Okay, I'm really excited to put this on. Wait. Are my hands too? It's not made for me? <laughs> not, your big boy hands don't fit in. <laughs> big boy. Let's just act like we're in middle school together. Oh, okay. Hi, Amanda. Um, can you actually call me Mandy? Well, how was your weekend, Mandy? It was good. I just listened to Avril Lavigne and like, you know. Have you heard Ayana Gandhi's new album? Oh, she's cute. I support all women, but you're not really my tea. Yeah, I'm more of like a- Is that just a phase? I'm just like more of an alternative girl. Is that just a phase? 
Uh, I, all I know is I'm running away this weekend. I would really advise you against that because your parents would be mad. And yes, I have a layer of gooey glitter on my face, but still trust me, your parents would be mad. <laughs> I don't know if you're supposed to keep that on all day at school. Like that's like a 10 minute mask. I got it from Claire, so I'm gonna use it. It costs you $5. Okay. okay. Can we just work on science, Mandy? Who are you staring at? I don't need any of this shit. Who knows? I might start wearing these gloves every day because it does make me feel an extra level of uh, braggadocious on yeah. the in the room when I wear these. I love like people who wear stuff like this because like you know they're never thoroughly washing their hands all day because like you don't have to take these off. They're wiping and like you know what I mean. The it's... thing with these, you never have to wash it. Oh yeah. So it's like this isn't my actual skin, so why would I wash it? Who cares if there's poop streaks on them or pee streaks or whatever? <laughs> Ew, wiping with those. Oh, the ultimate item in avocado. Bath bomb. Unfortunately, we don't have a bathtub in this room, so we're gonna yeah. have to go to the good old shit off, which Fun. means the bathroom. Sounds good. Why is it so hard to open? Do you have this on camera? Yeah. Okay. I'm rolling. The avocado is being insulted. Is it a pregnant avocado? <gasps> oh, it's starting. <gasps> this is <laughs> fucking cool. This is fucking cool. I'm giving this the A plus. It smells good. Am I gonna get a chemical bond? Leave, leave, leave. Oh, okay. I cannot believe that I saved the best item for last. Okay, we need to peel this out first, actually. It kind of is like. Um... I don't know if it will peel. <gasps> okay. Okay. This is good enough for now. Yeah. This is what I was most excited for the last item of this $150 haul. Flavored chopstick. You only got two? Yeah, I got no, only? I got two. Was what for both of us? I remember at the store like getting more. Conspiracy? One another dimension? I think I put it in the cart, then you put it back. Uh, it's okay. Wait, this is sick though. So there's a chapstick and then a lip smacker. What's a lip smacker? I'm pretty sure it is. Oh, maybe it's like lip gloss vibes. I'm taking off my glove because um I didn't want to keep flexing on y'all. This one is Coca-Cola flavored. And then mine is a chapstick lip balm and it's nerds flavored. Cause I'm a little nerd. Smells good. <laughs> so funny the way you're putting it on. This isn't a commercial. It's actually lipstick too. It stained your lips um like a white color. Tastes good. Okay. Right. I kinda wanna try that one. I got stuff on it. Do you care? What is that? Just stuff on my mask. Oh. That actually tastes like Coca-Cola, but licking your lips, it doesn't taste good, but when you put it on your lips, you can just like taste it in your mouth. I couldn't really taste this one because that wasn't my first one. I think I like Nord's butter because it tasted kinda like um, fruity, which I like. By the way, actually don't eat these. I don't want to be responsible if you um die from eating these. I like these, but I never would get them again because I doubt they do any moisturizing. Yeah, no offense, but I use Aquaphor. Um, any other type of chapstick kind of um makes your chip you makes your lips chapped because I want you to keep buying more. That's a conspiracy. I mean, this was a full complete day at Claire's. I know. I had fun. Subscribe to both of us. Um, I recommend everyone to have a Claire's day, to be honest. And, um, please compliment my airings, and goodbye, Zs! Thanks for watching! Bye!